it had have they the become the best kids. division in football now no they're not even what? mediocre yet this is they're a still the question they're still the worst division <laughs> in football and but the thing is the sad part is is every team got better in that division and they're still the worst team or they're still the worst division in all of football the, the, I the still NFC think that East, they'll be better because of their schedule. They'll be better than the NFC North this year because the, of that NFC North schedule. I think I still think schedule though wise, I still think the NFC North is good enough that they'll, they're still not as bad as the NFC East. The NFC East has always had a trend of being the worst, but that making them the best. And what I mean by that is they're the worst division. So when they play each other, it's always the best games because they're yeah. all terrible. 99.9% of the time. That's the way I've yeah, always looked and, at the NFC East. Not only that, but then, I mean, you've got to look at divisions like the NFC South. You've got to look at divisions like the NFC West, the AFC West, uh, and, and even the uh, the AFC North is going to be extremely competitive. So I, I just, the NFC East is going to be one of the two to three worst divisions in football this year. Do you guys think that the NFC North is really that bad, though? Because I, 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 I don't. I think, I think their the schedule North is, is really brutal. good this year. I think I, I think brutal, that they're good too, but that's that that schedule is brutal. That I, not only do they beat up on each other inside of the division, but then they go outside of the division and they don't have any like cream puff games. They're playing the NFC West. They're playing the AFC West. Like it is, it is a brutal schedule all the way well, through yeah, the NFC North. You got to. I don't think they have too, two like, ten win teams this year. I think I think they might. I th- I really do. I think they might actually even possibly have three depending on how good the bears will be i've got one I, i've got the vikings winning that division at 10 and 7 and then i've I've got nobody else with more than eight wins like it's just if this the packers, division is bad if the packers have aaron Rodgers. you only give them eight wins if the packers have if the packers have aaron Rodgers, then i'll give them i'll give them probably 10 so you know if minnesota holds true and wins 10 then They'll have two 10 win teams, but I don't think that they're going to win more. It's just, it's a brutal schedule, man. It really is. I mean, you, you look at, you look at the Packers schedule alone. The Packers start the season off with new Orleans and they play Detroit, but then they play San Francisco, Pittsburgh, Cincinnati. Then they get the bears, you know, in Chicago, which these, these NFC North division games are all. I heard, tough. I heard one tiff. I heard one tough game and that was Pittsburgh. What? San Francisco, nah. New Orleans, no. What? Then they get Washington. Then they get Arizona. Then Kansas City. Arizona. Then Minnesota. Nothing. Stop it. Then you get the Rams. You get the the Ravens. You get the Browns. I mean, those are all of your out of division games. Like, that's I, mean, I think it's that's it's a tough out. schedule. That's a that's a thirteen and four schedule. Get the. I think, <clears throat> I think it's a twelve and five schedule. I think I'm right up there with him. For the Packers, at least it, it yeah, is. Aaron's there because if ben, because you're, you're letting uh, your fandom talk right now. You're not no. letting logic talk. We, we, talk we were thirteen Arizona, and three the last two years, tough. and nothing's changed. We've only gotten better. We were thirteen and three the last two years. What, what else has shown you that we're going to be ten and seven all of a sudden? So we're You've been go, thirteen and three, but you haven't played a schedule like this. We, we played we, the Chiefs so in we, the last two years. All right, so eight, you played the Chiefs. Who eight. else other than the Chiefs have you played? So we go. We go eight. Same AFC West division. We go eight no at home, and we go, you know, four and four on the road. So what, we played the NFC like, South last year. Who had three good teams and then a dumpster fire in Atlanta. I mean, we we've played I'll say some tough. Teams. We go five. Say we go five and four on the road. So that's thirteen and four. Last year, you played out of, out of division. You played Atlanta. You played New Orleans. You played that Tampa. Tough. That was tough. You played you played Houston. That wasn't tough. You played uh San Francisco, which was horrible last year. You played Jacksonville. Still good defense. You played stop it. You played Jacksonville. Their their entire defense was hurt last year. Stop it. They were still a top five defense last year statistically. Yeah. Then you played Jacksonville. You played Indianapolis, who just didn't have a quarterback last tough. year. They beat us in Phillip, overtime. It was Phillip, a tough game. Philip Rivers had a good year last year. What are you talking about? They uh, how many playoff games Carson did they wins? win? One? Oh. None. They None. didn't win one. Zero. Uh, then you played the Philadelphia. Bills. You played Carolina. You did not play the Bills. No, they played the Bills. That's what I'm saying. They played oh, the Bills. That's who they lost to. 
Yeah. They lost to the Bills. And so then you got Philly, you got Carolina. Like, you did not play a tough schedule last year. Stop it. You, I mean, you want to go back to 2019? You think you.